Well, hey y'all, it's Friday morning. Actually, it's almost noon on Friday. But after having last week off, well, I wasn't off. All of my girls were off, and so I decided not to try to tackle this all by myself on editing and posting and all the things. So, I missed y'all last week. I think I missed it because this feels like a therapy session to me. And I love all the feedback and comments and messages I get after I do these. Um, so, it's been really encouraging for me to keep doing them for a bit. They're certainly not life-changing or any... I don't know, profound words of wisdom. But for me, taking just a few minutes to reflect on either the past week or the upcoming week or any struggles that I have right now, it makes me really feel like I'm talking to a therapist, but I kind of am, right? I'm talking to all my friends. And that's what we need to be for each other. When I think about what's on my heart this week, I'm struggling with so many things. Um, and Katie got in town last night and we were talking a little bit this morning about Jelly Roll's new song, I'm Not Okay, and how hard it is for people to just say, I'm not okay. And we all tell our friends that it's okay to not be okay, right? Like our super close circle and like talk to me or cry to me or vent to me or whatever it is. But it made me think and I tried to word this to Katie and I didn't do very well, so I'm gonna try it here with y'all. It made me go, maybe that's a lot of what I'm struggling with is being able to tell myself that it's okay to not be okay. Um, like I could say it to people that I'm close to that say, how are you? I could just be like, I'm struggling, I'm not okay. But with myself, I'm so, so hard on myself. And I seem to fight the battle daily and hourly to, how do I put this? To not think of my worth, my worth as a person on this earth as being what my bank account shows. Like if it's monetary things that show our worth, like I struggle with that and saying it out loud. I know that's not true. I know God made me to be more. I know it. And that's what I was trying to talk to Katie about. It's like, if we know that we're a child of God, and if we know every person is born with a hole in their heart somewhere that only God can fill. And if I do all I can, probably not all I can, we can always do better. But I strive to have a relationship with him and I pray for guidance and I pray for know all the little details and but then the next day or the next hour or the next bad thing that happens and say I don't have money to bless somebody the way I want to I don't have money to pay a bill I don't have money for payroll and have to pick one person to be late you know a half a day or a day like all of those things go so deep to me that I feel like I'm just worthless. And I cannot believe I'm saying all this stuff publicly. But talking to Katie, we need, what we agreed on is it needs to be more normal to say we're not okay. There's no way I'm the only person that says, I wanna call in bed and keep the covers over my head all day. Like I don't have the strength to do it one more day. Um, I know that I do. I mean, God tells me we can do anything. I know that I do from my past. I used to have lots of days raising Keller by myself because I wasn't one of those single moms that got rid of my child every other weekend to have a break. I did it day in and day out. And heck, he's going to be 29 in a couple of weeks and still living on my property. I mean, but I remember the days when he was younger, like, I can't do one more day. I can't do one more day with a teacher conference. I can't do one more day with an injury from football. I can't do one more day of somebody that needs to eat every two hours, like whatever it is. But I can because I did it. So, see, after a few minutes, I already feel better just talking to y'all. But can we, can we do that? Can we make a pact to make it okay for us to tell each other when we're not okay and not be worried about being judged? Can we 
make a pact to remind each other when we see the other one being hard on themselves that it's okay to say to ourselves, it's okay. It's okay to not be perfect. It's okay to not be okay and need rest. Y'all know I chose that for my word this year. Um, I, there's so many things that aren't okay. That doesn't mean that we're not grateful. We can be grateful and grieving at the same time. We can be grateful and struggling in other areas at the same time. I mean, showing gratitude and expressing gratitude certainly makes a whole lot of things better. But I guess there's just no magic pill. And I guess if we prayed to God to fill that hole and show us what we're truly worthy of, and we only prayed it once and it was magically fixed, then maybe we wouldn't talk to him as much as we do. Maybe that's the lesson in that, that we need to be reminded daily to go to him for our worth. Anyway, I don't know if any of this makes sense, but that's what's on my heart this week. I hope if you're struggling, you know you're not alone. And um, I hope if you're struggling, maybe do like me. Let's find some time to play with paper this weekend. That fixes a lot of things. All right, I love y'all. Happy Friday.